Wow, you know what? I'm really sitting here thinking of Mexico and I'm really, really missing those tacos. <laughs> I like tacos. I mean, who doesn't, right? Wasn't it just a phenomenal country? The way where, it doesn't matter where you go, there's someone performing, there's someone entertaining you. Can you remember the noises of the mariachi band? Well, it was something like that. Anyway. They're loud, mariachi. You didn't like them that much. I just got over them, they're just like everywhere. <laughs> Don't, I'm a musician, I love the mariachi music, it's fantastic. You know what, I was just thinking about the fantastic conversation we had there, especially about purpose and revisioning. And I was so inspired when you just shared with me again the way you feel about the Circle of Excellence group and what your real purpose is for this group of companies. Do you remember that conversation? I do, but people don't think of purpose. That's They think they've got it, but they don't. They don't. And do you remember when you actually you, you presented numbers to me and very interesting sacred numbers. Can you refresh my memory? Of course. Well, I, th I think that it was just time, you know. The last time we did this was literally five years ago. So, and a lot's changed and, you know, purposes do change. That's the first thing. So, yeah. I realized that our overall mission hasn't changed. And our mission has always been to create the number one team of conscious leaders on the planet. Yeah. But, but how do you quantify that? And that's where the sacred number of 432, which comes from the procession of the equinoxes, but also comes from the Vedas, it comes from the Viking Sadas, comes from the Bhagavad Gita. That number is represented in all of the ancient scriptures. It's in the it's in the mathematics of the pyramid. It's in the it's in the the cosmos. And it's four three two. Four right? three two, and it's also in music as well. But that's for another day. But I realised that if we just focused on building four hundred and thirty two conscious leaders, that each of those conscious leaders, by the nature of their impact and the amount of people they have following them, and and you know looking at what they're doing, whether it be in the health space, the business space, the mindset space, the spiritual space, I realized that that would mean that you and I and the circle of excellence would actually affect well in excess of a million people. And that's a country the size of Mauritius. So that's where we came from. And I know when I told you that you just went, that's incredible. That's what we've been looking for because it's so quantifiable.